I'm Peter Jones, editor at County Deer Stalking. It's September, and this month we're stalking in the Garden of England for the hardy and highly vocal seeker deer. The tension builds as we aim to illustrate to you the importance of species identification and some of the challenges involved with selecting a specific beast from a herd. If you get a chance before setting out deer stalking, it's well worth taking a few minutes to check the zero of your rifle. Introduced from the Far East in 1860, seeker deer in the UK can be divided into three subspecies, Japanese, Formosan and Manchurian. Though usually unsocial, the seeker on this ground we're stalking can be found in close proximity to fallow deer. At this time of year, it's just the males that are in season. That said, our specific cull priority today is a seeker bracket. After an initial short stalk, we head to a high seat. Within 20 minutes, we're rewarded when some fallow cross at the bottom of the ride. Just moments later, and a young pricket also steps out just in front of the high seat. However, he's not the animal that we're after, and so we let him be. With precise cull requirements, species identification is an important aspect of deer stalking especially when sometimes you only have seconds to make a decision. With Seeker on the agenda today, we climb down from the high seat and set out on foot. Right. Okay, so we've got some Seeker deer up in front of us. A little group of them up on the hill. I don't even quite catch them. Stalk in a little bit closer and uh, see if we can get a shot. On the hillside ahead, we glass a mixed group of fallow and seeker. Selecting an animal from a herd is surprisingly difficult, as it's crucial that you consider your background. With a typical heart long shot, the bullet will usually pass straight through your target and unless you're careful, you may injure another deer behind it. Here, we're forced to wait long minutes with our chosen seeker pricket crisscrossing in front and behind other deer before an opportunity finally presents itself. At a little over 200 yards, and with our selected stag now clear of the adjacent animal, we take the shot. Are you on him? Yeah. The reaction of this animal illustrates beautifully the need to watch for shot reaction. Mm. It's also where experience tells. Seeker stags are hardy beasts. This animal absorbs the initial shock of the 100 grain bullet and gets mm. back up in an attempt to run with the herd. We reload and cover the animal. So, there we are. Really tense stuff there, actually. Um, a very good lesson in culling animals out of a herd. Um, you could see our seeker pricket, because that's what we're after here today, just alongside another animal. As he edged forward, they crossed over and of course you have to be super careful when that happens you can't take a shot a broadside shot at that point because you may injure the animal that's behind him because the bullet travels through the heart and lungs and can come out the other side and cause a nasty injury to the, to the other animal so that's why we always have to wait for them to come clear so you could see on that occasion as the pricket came clear as he came clear of the other one that's when we took the shot it might be a little bit high but nonetheless it's a heart lung shot a good sort of 200 a little over 200 yards so fingers crossed and um, it, it'll be a well placed shot but what we're going to do now we're going to give it five minutes and then we're going to go up and uh, retrieve our animal. Great stuff, so here we are. Pretty tense stuff actually, <laughs> um, but I'm really pleased we got our animal. Uh, it's a seeker stag um, and it's a first year stag and that's why we call them prickets. And you can see we've got a pricket here because we've got, I don't know, a few inches there, five or six inches of uh, antler growth. So just the animal that we were after. 
very tense as I say trying to take him out of the herd uh, but all good news lovely chestnut coat here with dappled spots along the back there beautiful very tough animals very secretive animals very vocal animals but uh, but uh, uh, you know a, a beautiful animal to have taken out there as for shot placement a little bit high as I suspected but uh, my bullet has uh, has come out there so uh, not bad that's our quartering shot we're looking at a, at a heart lung shot which is just what we're trying to do when we're stalking animals um, but uh, yeah all in all very tense but a great stalk and uh, yeah, I'm just chuffed a bit we've got a result that's it for this month next month we'll be coming to you from Scotland where we hope to have footage for you from the final days of this year's red rut in the meantime, if you'd like to have a go at stalking seeker or fallow with us, then please contact us via the website for more details.